Good day. Welcome to the MeCat Minute, where we will show you a daily tip and trick, a basic workflow, or a good to know feature within SolidWorks. My name is Rudolf, and today I will be showing you how to take a spiral part and convert it into a sheet metal part for flattening. If we, if we look at this spiral assembly, um, this is used in big industrial mixes or even small mixes. The problem we are facing here that we want to take um, this specific part and create a sheet metal component out of it so that we can send it through for laser cutting. If we look at this component, uh, what we need to do is we, we need to convert this part into a sheet metal so that we can have a flattened state. So let's use our sheet metal feature first and see what happens. So if I go to sheet metal, convert to sheet metal, it's asking me for a select a fixed entity. So what happens if I select that one? You will notice it doesn't pick up the bends. All right, so we need to have another way of converting this to sheet metal. So to do this, what we uh, can do is we are going to create two separate 3D sketches. So I'm going to go sketch, 3D sketch. Now I'm going to go convert entities. And I'm going to convert this spiral and select OK, close that down, and I'm going to do exactly the same, but now for this part, I'm going to go to Sketch, 3D Sketch, Convert Entities, and select this part, select OK. Okay, notice that we have two separate 3D sketches now. So what I can do now is I can hide the original part, and we are left with the two 3D sketches. Now, to create a sheet metal component out of this, we are going to use the function called lofted bend. So, for lofted bend, uh, we are going to use the formed manufacturing method. I'm going to select both of these 3D sketches and I'm going to define a thickness of 3 millimeters and I'm going to select OK. And there we have it. We have just created a sheet metal component. And notice that we've got our flat pattern. So press, so I'm just going to unsuppress my flat pattern. There we go. And now we can send this, save it out to CDXF and send it through to laser cutting. That was it. Thank you so much for your time and have a good day. Goodbye.